The park behind us is a real passion of mine. Um, it all started when I was in high school. I saw an ad in the paper for youth leaders, so I applied for youth leaders um, and became a part of that. And a part of youth leaders is needing a project. And I said, I can see the need and the want for a park upgrade in Clifton, which has come to fruition now. Um, it's great to see that all the pieces of the puzzle are finally coming together. One of the great success stories of what we see here today is the collaboration between the Youth Advisory Committee and Council. So Adam Hungerford's done an amazing job, uh, some great initiative. Uh, he took part in, in the whole process, obviously uh, did a lot of work around the community, interviewed students and, and played an active role in, in, in what's happening in his community. This is something I will stand back and look at for the rest of my life and be able to go, I was a part of this. Um, this is something that I know that I did to help my community. It's all about connectivity and meeting place and basically this one's connecting the Elsie Jones walkway and parkland to George Street, providing some extra pathland, some seating op uh, options uh, and a good place to stop and connect and chat with other members of the community. Great to see uh, a large uh, cohort of mums and prams and bike riders on the coming across on the side and, and I suppose that's, that's what we're all about, getting people active and out and into the community. Now, wherever that is across the region, and this is a great example of that.